Imagine being just nine months old, subjected to an experiment that would forever etch its place in the annals of history as one of the most horrifying in psychology. This is the story of little Albert. In 1920, John B. Watson, a prominent psychologist, set out to prove how emotions could be conditioned in humans. The subject, a baby named Albert B. At first, Albert showed no fear toward the white rat or other items, but Watson had a sinister plan. Each time Albert reached for the rat, Watson struck a hammer against a steel bar, creating a deafening noise. Over seven weeks, this pairing was repeated. Soon, Albert began to cry, not only at the sight of the rat, but at anything white. Blankets, masks, even cotton balls. Watson had proven his theory of classical conditioning in humans. But at what cost? Albert was left terrified of something as innocent as the color white. Worse, Watson never reversed the fear. Albert, whose real name was Douglas Merritt, moved away and tragically died at the age of six from hydrocephalus. Today, this experiment is condemned as unethical and inhumane. The Little Albert experiment stands as a chilling reminder of the need for ethical guidelines in research. What do you think about the Little Albert experiment? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe Stormzy Reels, and hit the bell icon for more thought-provoking content.